Well, hello, this is Kyle Kyle's Tracks and Trails. Hopefully everyone's having a good afternoon. Um, I'm just out here exploring real quick because I'm looking for a spot to put my hot tent. I'm out exploring your area. I think I found a spot and I'll show you that guys here in a minute. But I want to get down here and show you what I took to explore with. Sometimes we just got to keep it simple. I'll get back with you guys. All right, here we go. This is what we have. I have stormproof matches. Black and white fire star stormproof match. Most of my fire kits fire is from um black and white fire star. I have cordage. I have strike on box match. I have a small fire rod. This thing does throw some sparks for such a small fire rod. I have a couple of these wood chips. I find these to be better to kind of shave on and strike them louder than I do the fire rod. I have the cotton balls, of course. Something to pit. When I do a resource walk to put something in. Let's see if I can do this one-handed. You guys have seen these before. Just unfold it. And I have a bag there. Just clip around my belt just like that. I have gloves, of course. I have my Pathfinder Canteen. And I just recently purchased another case that goes inside of it. They finally came back out with those. I was wanting one. And then I have some form of shelter. This, in this case, is my military rain poncho here. The Hell Contacts one. And that has a whole kit in there. Now, let's get to the parts I want to show you. Right there, I believe I can fit in the hot tent. There's no dead falls, there's no nothing. And I tell you what, guys, it's beautiful out here. Look at that sun. Where'd it go? There we go. Can't really see it on my phone. But anyways, let's go over here. As far as resources, I have some punk wood. Well, I know about punk wood, but I'll show you anyways. Spongy. As long as you can do that, bounce it back, that's good to char. Over here. We have, and we have some back this way too, but we're headed over here anyways. We have all kinds of birch bark. I mean, it's just hanging there, waiting to be peeled off there. And there's another one right there. There's... One over there, which I might pick on that one because I like the way it looks with the birch bark. It's thinner. And then I think we have one or two back this way. Um, as far as water is concerned, now I didn't know it was It's my first time being back this way. We have water. Got a small creek here. No fish in it. Might be frogs, I don't know. I haven't really, I've never been up in here. Now, there's a house right there. That might be their land. I believe from what my girlfriend was telling me, our house is somewhere up in here. So I'm pretty sure I'm on her land. At least we'll find out. Um, then you come over here. I still have to deal with the railroad tracks, which we're going to explore this creek sooner. Because I want, there's a river back this way I want to explore. Plus, there might be our spots to camp there. And another thing we got as far as cleaning resources look at the firewood. All kinds of down stuff. I was kind of worried about this spot when I saw the down stuff, but in the area where I was shown, I like to set my high tent. Nothing. We're good there. We're coming out here. So put in firewood. Some there. All over the place. That's good to see. But down here, of course, are the railroad tracks. Getting down from here. I've had no issues getting on this hill here, but it becomes a complete drop off. So that's something I'm not going to do from here because I don't want to break my neck. 
So I might explore. It may not be possible. But I'm going to try. Maybe tomorrow see if I can get down there. So I wouldn't mind exploring a little bit more. It looks like another hill back that way. If I were to get down there. But there's a river right there. So something I want to explore. We'll explore that later. I don't see. Look at this. There's a tree that came right out of the ground. Roots still attached. Yeah. I'm not really seeing a spot. If I can climb down, that potentially break my neck. I'll explore a little bit more. I might just be able to walk and come down this way. I'm not going to bore you guys with that one. But anyways, I could get out of here. But anyways, this is Kyle Kyle's Tracks and Trails. Y'all know what to do. If you like the video, hit the thumbs up. And of course, subscribe to me. We're up to 1,006, I believe. And for those that are subscribed to me, thanks very much for hanging out in the woods with me for today. I do appreciate y'all. Another thing we can do... Let's hit our notification about where we can stay notified. And also, go ahead and drop me a comment. I do appreciate and enjoy the comments so I learn off each other. And another thing we do is share the video over on social media. That way we know about giveaways and stuff like that. And don't forget about this giveaway. I'll start writing names down. Next week, probably, I'll pick a name. I might wait another week. I'm not sure yet. Let more people get involved. This one's kind of a big giveaway, so... I might wait another week just to let more people get involved with it. But do share the video out. That giveaway video. That way more people can get to my channel and subscribe to me. But anyways, I'm talking too much. This is Kyle Kyle Strikes Trust. I am out of here. I appreciate y'all. See y'all next one.